What's your name? Margaret. Wouldn't you rather flirt with those girls down there? No. I like you, Margaret. Wow, this is all happening mighty quick. I am a divorcee with a child. Walter is a blessing. Mm. I felt like, you know, after doing lots of big movies, I kind of wanted to do something on a, on a smaller scale and uh, just work with actors and not have a lot of effects and things. There's not enough superlatives in the English language to explain my experience of working with him, with the crew. And action! He is awesome. I think she identified with Margaret's shyness and her internal and her conflict and and kind of getting swept up into something and having a child and doing all of that. I think the elements of her having a child and, and, and understanding that just made it very strong for her. And uh, and I mean, it's, it's the most crucial role in the sense that it's, it's obviously Walter's the bigger, more demonstrative character, but it's very difficult, I think, to play somebody so internal and, and first time I talked to Amy about it she just I just knew she could do it and and I mean she's such a you know I think she she's one of those actors that could play anything I painted them I did every single one of them every big eye me and no one will ever know but you you know Tim is not so much interested in showing you that he's Tim Burton he is interested in making this movie. And action! And that's how we work. And that's why this, this triangle, if you want to call it such, is, is wonderfully balanced and, um, and uh, energized and, and um, more or less, you know, ego-free. It's a cabal. Is a secret society of gallery owners and critics who get together for Sunday brunch in Sausalito, deciding what's cool and what isn't. The idea of being somebody who's charming but but bully and, and menacing and and and, and you know, it, 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 just a contradiction of, of a human being. And, and there's a sadness about him as well that that, that I find is as big of a you know a horrible person as he is. You know, everybody has has different aspects to their character, and Christoph's able to kind of bring all of those together, you know, in, in, in one performance. How long did that piece take to execute? That? Mm. Probably, well, months. You know, first the thinking, the sketching, then the time with just me and the oils. Oils? But isn't that acrylic? Ah, that, yeah. <laughs> I thought he was gonna be more eccentric. But he's wonderful. He's a lovely man. The man I met was uh, an extraordinary, gentle, kind, um, polite man. Tim is, is such a great director. He communicates really well. He's a technical director, but he also communicates to actors. Like he's, he's the real deal. It's so incredible. He's so lovely and sweet and warm and, and encouraging. Hey, baby. Killer party. It's a happening. You know when you idolize somebody and then you meet them and they turn out to just be great? It's the best. It's like a mirage. From a distance, you look like a painter. But up close, there's just not much there. That's an outrageous statement! So, who is the artist?